Finding your favorite fiction hardcover comes at no shortage at Paseo Verde Library, but downloading the latest ebook may be another story. So while we could check out a physical book as many times as it would, you know, go off the shelf, um, we don't have that same freedom with an electronic book. Marcy Smedley with Henderson Library says a hardcover bestseller only costs them an average $25 per book. However, if we were to purchase an electronic book, we're spending more like $45 to $65, um, and that comes with limitations on it. It's called metered access, meaning how long they own the book is up to the publisher. Which basically means we get that material for one to two years or for 26 to 52 checkouts. The convenience of reading has noticeably shifted in recent years. Users can download books right to their devices, but the sudden move from ink and paper tends to come around the time of giving. They come in and need that help with how do I how do I then get these um, applications on my device so that I can download this kind of content. To keep up, Henderson Libraries purchases multiple ebooks at a time, considering the ebook can only be checked out to one person at a time. We are limited with the revenue streams that we have, um, and we don't see those grow as fast as the expense of the materials. Smedley says they adjust their budget to add these items, but it's because of donations and contributions they are able to stock their virtual shelves. And Smedley ran a recent report showing over 3,000 physical books have been checked out more than 60 times. And to do that with ebooks, they would have to keep repurchasing the content once the license expires. Gerard, back to you. Alexis, thank you for the report.